Welcome back, ladies and gents, to the Final Fantasy Tactics Arena Tournament. I'm your host, Fanatic, and this is Match 78, the Frisky Dingo versus Shade. For Frisky Dingo, we have Doomy the Paladin, a favorite Lancer, Act Like a Summoner, and Piece of Bacon the Scholar. All together, Doomy a favor, Act Like a Piece of Bacon. FTC, we have, or for Shade, we have FTC first, Shade second. So... Yeah, and he's a, you got a paladin, chemist, paladin, and chemist. All right, and this first match is going to be map uh, 13 here, inside Lionel. And here we go. The shade is in the black. The frisky dingo is in the, it's blue, teal kind of. All right, Shade starts off with a death sentence that misses and is echoed by his other chemist, but this one hits. A little haste action from Frisky Dingo's uh, Paladin. Small damage gunshot. Pretty good damage for a bow, 170, it's not bad. And Summoner's there for the kill. Kagasogi blinds and does very good damage. Death sentenced uh, summoner pretty much wastes a turn using Mad Scientist. Holy hits, drops Shade's first chemist, but she's right back up, doing herself. And retreating. And McDerivan on the other chemist puts both units to sleep. Wow. Just like that, Frisky's got two units disabled. Now, Summoner does have white magic, though, but I guess she doesn't have a Suna. Otherwise, I'm assuming she'd be using it right about now. Gunshot Kagasogi later. She's down. Now, it's just now the chem is by herself. And she's down, too. So, basically, uh, this match, is, this uh, round, I should say, is probably... Well, I'm sorry. I, I, Chemist was on Chase team. Duh. Well... Doesn't really matter at this point. They're all pretty much disabled at this point. Officially now. Yes, okay. Uh, Shade now has all of his team members alive. Whereas Frisky Dingo has all of his team members kind of either sleeping, critical, or death sentence. So this round is definitely going to sh uh, the Shade. And this might be a bit of a wait, uh, since I'm willing to bet that the combination of death sentence and sleep are going to make them ignore the sleeping unit. So they're not going to, oh, well finally sleep wears off. Paralyzed hits, but it won't matter in a second because she's about to die. Wait for it. Wait for it. Nope, done. Welcome back to round two. This is Frisky Dingo versus Shade. And again, Shade's in the black, Frisky Dingo in the blue. First round uh, went to Shade pretty convincingly. Let's see if uh, Frisky Dingo can change that and force a tiebreaker. Kim is moving first. Frisky's Paladin. Hasting his buddy will answer. Shades team inching forward. We know we expect a lot of uh, death sentence and mimic derivons from the chemist there. Speaking of which, we have our first MD. And it misses. Other chemist too far away, can't do anything. Poke for pretty good damage. Half of it negated. Give me the Paladin. Buff his team. Some Kagasogi gunning. 
I'll make the Lancer be able to survive the second one, but he is blinded, so that kind of screws that up. So 450 damage, I believe, done the uh, Lancer, a third of that returned to his enemies, but still, that's yeah, about 300 damage there. That kind of hurts. Three attacks later, he's still standing. But he's forced to heal and run. He'll survive another Kagasogi, but only barely. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. And finally, everyone on the Frisky Dingo's team is hasted and regen. Summoner is dropping a holy bomb. Scholar is going for Petrify, 58%. Pretty good ch uh, chance there. Kagasugi gunning. And this will probably be a fatal one. Nope. It's ninjutsu for exactly enough damage to kill her. Petrify hits. That chemist is a statue, so re raise not going to help her out too much. However, soft kind of remedies that problem. Ooh, 22, uh, 222 damage does not hit. We have another Petrify. This one's a little bit lower. 41% I believe. Well, those chemists are pretty quick though. I think you need at least two status users in order to outstatus them. The two chemists are going to be uh, doing a pretty good job there. Summoner is still rotting. Not sure why Frisky's team is abandoning her. Guess they don't like her that much. Looking for some mad science here. Oh, finally we got a revival, and it's just in time too. Now she has to actually take a turn. So means she doesn't get picked off by those Kagasogi gunners down there. Death sentence does not hit. Google goes off. And Frisky's team is back at pretty good hit points. More Kagasogi gunning, more damage split. The Paladin and the Lancer can take it. Oh, four panel haste regen. Very nice. However, that's also a four panel Mimic Derivon. And the entirety of Frisky Dingo's team is asleep. Gentlemen, this might do it. And ladies, I do believe this is probably it for Frisky Dingo. Unless that happens. Does the summoner have Asuna? If she does, she might be able to wake up her entire team. She does have white magic. But nope, she does not have Asuna, or at least she prefers to holy the uh, chemist instead. Because it wasn't a fatal holy, I'm assuming she just doesn't have Asuna. I'm really certain the AI would pick that over holy at that point. And now she's death sentenced. And she's still thinking about holies. Instead of waking up her demons. And just who wakes up a scholar. going for a petrify. No, actually, I've been kind of knocking that uh, uh, summoner there, but she's uh, she might be onto something there. Since it looks like... Uh... Oh, that miss kind of hurts. I mean, really, it looks like they're not exactly... Uh... Shade's team isn't really taking advantage of the fact those two units are asleep. I mean, 74 damage is not exactly that impressive. Are, they out of, are the knights out of magic? Or the paladins out of... No, they have plenty of magic points. Oh, there we go. There's the Kakasogi gunning I was waiting for.
I guess it's the angle, they can't get a good, any good gunshots. At least they couldn't, now they probably can. Beguile, finally. That could change things around if it hits. But it does not. Okay, so we gunning drops the knife. The Lancer is finally back up, but half of Frisky Juno's team is knocked out. Lancer revives. The scholar's down thanks to you know mad scientist and run. And the summoner's down, yep. That's the problem with Phoenix down base surviving, you're pretty much gonna get hit. Get KO by the first unit to go, it's not your own team. So it's probably gonna be a revival loop until Shade wins, so. Frisky Dingo, looks like this might be it for you. There's just too much sleep and too much Kagasuki gun. Three three seven damage there. That's pretty. Uh, what you really need, forty nine percent misses, is the CT to line up just right. Oh, the team is pretty much blocking them off. One guy, one unit is permanently uh, disabled. Ironically, that was probably the most helpful thing that could have happened right there for as far as Frisky Dingo is concerned. He was finally get around to killing her. 80% death, and it is. Shade takes the match. Good game, both of you.